Ibra to the fight over our environment. The operation to rescue the last swathes of trees that make up the Maasai Mau forest from human encroachment is now a week old. The area is now marked by officers on patrol and people packing up their belongings and moving out. This is where a number of rivers spring up, including the Mara River, where the reality of the destruction is more glaring downstream as Bridget Ngana found out. From this viewpoint, we get to appreciate the vastness of the Maasai Mara Game Reserve and the wildlife that brings scores of tourists to this corner south of the Rift Valley. From here, we spot the Sand River, a tributary of the Great Mara River. But just like the name suggests, only the sand on its withered bed can be seen as vultures circle around a carcass. Lately, the water levels of the Mara River and her tributaries have been on the decline. In fact, by January, this river is dry completely. There will be no water here. And obviously, wild beasts and other wildlife species that uh, inhabit this place will not be coming here because there is no water. In the past, the great wildebeest migration, one of nature's wonders, would take more than three months. But now, this annual stampede has become unpredictable. The question is, how can we rescue the situation now? And the only way we can rescue the situation is by getting rid of the people in the forest and then beginning a very long, painful process of rebuilding the forest, of uh, restoring the forest. The Mara River stretches 270 kilometers through Kenya into Tanzania, supporting the circle of life of millions of people and wildlife like the wildebeest. The operation to restore the source of the Mara has been deemed critical and necessary. If we clear this forest, then we are done as a county. So it is just a matter of life and death. We have to choose. We destroy the Masai Mau forest, we suffer forever. It's going to be, it's a, it's, a, it's a serious disaster in waiting that we have to address. As the Mara River continues on its course here, the Mara Triangle, there is a sense that the water levels are still not to the desired standards as it used to flow some years back. Ghana, NTV. Now